Firstly, can we ask you a few questions about your time in the army? What made you want to join the army? It was a childhood ambition of mine when I was a kid. Um, so when I was your age, I was probably the ones running around with army face paint on and dressed as a soldier. And it was just an ambition I wanted to do as a young boy. How long did you serve for? I served for seven years in the British Army um, with a regiment called the Royal Artillery. I was based over in Germany. What rank are you? I was a corporal, so that was two stripes. That was one underneath the sergeant. Have you been to many interesting places? Um, I've been all over the world. I've been to Canada, Kosovo, um, Iraq, Cyprus, um, all over the world. What are your favourite memories of your time in the military? Making, uh, making huge friends, um, the comradeship, working together and being part of a big team. Are you still in contact with all those friends? Yeah, very much so and most of them actually work for me now. Was it a hard decision to leave? Uh, it was, yeah. Uh, I thought I was going to stay in for 22 years, but after seven years, enough was enough. Moving on to the work you were doing at college, going to high school, what made you think about helping children? Um, I want to pass my experiences on to you, so if you can become more confident, more disciplined, have good self-esteem, work as a team, by learning from me, then that's why I want to be here and that's what I want to do. In our school, you only work with year nines. Why is this? I think it was because of the uh, the school chose year nine to begin with. We're about to start another course today. Um, in the next couple of minutes, where we're going to meet year eight. So year eight have been chosen this time, um, but year nine is the chosen group to begin with. Why did you choose to help school kids instead of older pupils in college or university? We work right through schools, so we work in primary, secondary, and some special skills around the city as well. Um, we work with kids up to the age of 19 anyway, so we work across the board. Next question. What do you do in the sessions? We do all fun, exciting things. So we do like bushcraft and survival, military things, um, teach you how to be soldiers. We learn how to march, we learn how to work as a team. And it's all about bringing out your personal skills. What is the most challenging thing about the project? The project, I think the most challenging thing was for the pupils to stay on task. So every week we, we, our aim was to improve on behaviour and listening skills. And for these boys to stick to this task was, uh, was probably the biggest challenge. How does it compare to your previous role in the army? Um, it's much more rewarding. Um, every day is a different day. I can never become too comfortable in my job because I don't know what you're all going to say and do and act, so I can't become um, comfortable. Do you see an improvement in the boys' behaviour? Definitely. I think we've had about an 84% improvement in the last 12 weeks throughout the group, so it's, uh, it's proven to work.